Savitri, page 324. None was apart, none lived for himself alone. Each lived for God in him and God in all. Each soulness inexpressibly held the whole. Their oneness was not tied to monotone. It sowed a thousand aspects of itself. Its calm, immutable stability abode on a changeless ground forever safe, compelled to a spontaneous servitude, the ever-changing incalculable steps, the seeming reckless dances subtle plan of immense world forces in their perfect play. Appearance looked back to its hidden truth and made of difference oneness smiling play. It made all persons fractions of the unique, yet all were beings secret integers. All struggle was turned to a sweet strife of love in the harmonized circle of a sure embrace. Identities reconciling happiness gave a rich security to difference. On a meeting line of hazardous extremes, the game of games was played to its breaking point, where through self-finding by divine self loss there leaps out unity's supreme delight, whose blissful undivided sweetness feels a communality of the absolute. There was no sob of suffering anywhere. The experience ran from point to point of joy. Bliss was the pure undying truth of things. All nature was a conscious friend of God. A wisdom worked in all, self more, self sure, a plenitude of illimitable light, an authenticity of intuitive truth, a glory and passion of creative force, infallible, leaping from eternity. The moment's thought inspired the passing act.